According to Senator Schweiker, here's how the compromise would work. The Virginia delegation in Congress would drop its objection to the Saratoga going to Philadelphia, and in return, the Pennsylvania delegation would support the awarding of a $2 billion contract to Newport News to build a new 90,000-ton Kennedy-class aircraft carrier. That's a much larger ship than President Carter wants, so Congress would have to force it on him. For that reason and others, First District Congressman Paul Tribble labels the Schweiker proposal wishful thinking. The possible compromises aside, Tribble says he expects Navy Secretary Graham Clater will decide soon which shipyard gets the Saratoga overhaul. In the meantime, the congressman is worried that a strike at the Newport News Yard will jeopardize its chances for the contract. The Steelworkers Union agrees and hopes the shipyard will realize the danger too and take steps to head off the walkout. Tribble Rubin, Area 10 Eyewitness News.